everyone, this is Ryan Reagan, the founding partner of HX. Recently, I received a lot of messages from students asking me for time management tips because now they have a lot of free time at home and uh, they want to do well and they want to study well during this free time, right? So today I'm going to share with you some time management tips that have allowed me to get over 40 out of 45 in the IB. If you think about it, all IB students have only 24 hours a day. Why do some students get 45 and why do some students fail, right? In the real world, why do some people like Bill Gates become immensely successful, but he only has the same amount of time as all of us, right? 24 hours a day. So one of the main differences is time management. So time management is extremely important if you want to do well. Okay, so I'm gonna share with you some concrete tips. So before the start of every day, I would suggest you to ask yourself, what do I want? What do I want to accomplish on each day? A lot of people would ask, what should I do? But that's the wrong question to ask. You should ask, what do I want? Okay, so for example, if I'm, if I'm an IB student, maybe I have a differentiation test next week, then I would, so what I want would probably be to get a level seven. Okay, so I want to get a level seven for that test. Then I want, then I'll ask, okay, this is what I want. So what do I need to do? Right, then you sort of lay out all the tasks that you need to do. So for example, maybe there are many parts in differentiation. So I would lay them all out and think about how I can master each part. So that would probably include like solving a lot of past exam questions, right? Learning how to solve the exam questions. So you need to ask yourself, what do I want? And then you think about what you need to do to achieve those things, right? So when you plan your schedule, you need to be task oriented. You need to be outcome focused. You need to think about what do you want, right? And then you plan your day accordingly. What do you want? And after you know what are your objectives, then you can think about plan out your day. So you, by the end of this, you should have a task list. So there is a list of tasks that you want to finish within that week. Okay, so come up with a task list. Okay, make sure that the list is very detailed. Like for example, you can, one task might be, I'll finish 10 years of differentiation question today, or maybe I'll finish two years of differentiation questions today, right? So have a very specific task, okay? So when you set your task list and when you actually study, one very important thing to remember is focus on what's important. So what do I mean by that? So for example, I see a lot of students when they study, they like to take out a highlighter, highlight different stuff, you know, like make their own notes and make them very colored, right? This, I, I told I really believe that this is a waste of time because it's not going to help you to achieve the result you want, which is to, so what is the result you want when you study? Normally it's to master concepts, to really understand concepts and you'll be able to solve exam questions, right? These are what's, this is what's important, right? So that's why you don't want, you want to focus on what's important and avoid anything that is going to distract you from that. Another tip is when you study, you're going to probably face a lot of distractions, right? Especially your phone, probably your phone. So that's why I would really suggest you to isolate yourself when you study, right? Put away your phone, put away your computer, right? And then just have your notes and maybe your, um, the exam questions right in front of you. On any IB subjects, you can register for a free trial with us at our website and the link in the description. Right? And there are a lot of IB resources you can download as well. And one more thing is, um, so what our lessons would do for you is that we have IB experts and we're, we have sorted out materials that will help you to dramatically increase the efficiency of your studying, right? So you don't need to find the resources yourself. It's all sorted for you. And then, if you study yourself, you probably need to read textbooks. It's going to take you a lot of time to master concepts. But if you have an expert explaining things to you, it can dramatically reduce the time that you need to master the concepts, right? Because as you know, everyone's, everyone only has 24 hours a day. So efficiency matters. So that's why if you, with, with, with our help, you can dramatically become more efficient and then you can achieve more within 24 hours, right? Of course, your own time management is very important as well. So I hope that this video is useful for you and see you next time.